Plasma is the most extreme state of matter in the universe. It only exists when there's enough energy in the system to strip atoms apart. Plasma is the fourth state of matter. It's simply an electrically charged gas. Now, you know about the states of matter. You know that we have solids, liquids, gases, and now we have plasma too. Matter changes state by gaining or losing energy. If we think about a solid, in a solid, the particles inside are in fairly fixed positions. They have a little bit of energy, so they vibrate a bit, but their positions are fixed and the solid material is rigid. Now, if we heat that solid, we give those particles a little bit of energy. So they start moving around a bit faster and they can break away from their fixed positions. Then the substance can flow and we have a liquid. Now, if we heat the liquid and give the particles more energy, they start moving even faster. Some of them will be able to escape from the surface of the liquid and become a gas. But now what happens if we give that gas even more energy? With even more energy, we can strip the gas particles into their separate charges. So a plasma is simply an electrically charged gas. It behaves a bit like a gas, but with extra effects due to these freely moving charges. Plasmas conduct electricity and they respond to magnetic fields. They're also very turbulent because these electric and magnetic fields feed back on each other. But they are also very beautiful because plasmas often emit light. Although we live on a planet dominated by solids, liquids and gases, in fact, the majority of the universe, more than 99.99%, is in the plasma state. And you're actually more familiar with plasmas than you think, because the sun is a plasma, lightning is a plasma, flames, neon lights, the aurora borealis. These are all plasmas that you're probably already familiar with and we make plasmas in fusion reactors when we recreate the sun.